And we're live. Hello, everybody. Today we're going to play uh, Escape First Alchemist. We've got me on the main screen, and we got my wife, Sam. Say, say hello. Hi. Uh, she's here, too. She's on the little screen. Um, and we're going to... This is a... Actually, you found this one, didn't you? Yeah. Um... What is this one? What is this game? <laughs> Straight up, I think Instagram recommended it to me. Um, it's just kind of like a basic room escape, but a fun little two-person one. The other um, games in this series, I guess, are all like VR ones. If you hear any snarfling, that's our pug in the background. She's working really hard to make it stink. She's working so hard to rub her face into everything in the room. But hello, Dingo. Or no, that's not Dingo. I saw the D and I assumed it was him. No, that's that's uh, that's ironic. Uh, so let me go ahead and read the, the, the plot here. The Alchemist, the illustrious lo laboratory of the Thumaturge, known only as Trismegistus. What, <laughs> what occult secrets lie within these halls, and why would he trap us here? At least, this is a chance to peek under the veil of the occult for a glimpse of truth into the designs of the Great Alchemist. And we don't have any Lips checkpoints. Glimpse always spelled that way. Glimpse? Is it... No, they misspelled the word glimpse. I was going to say, I'm pretty sure that P should be coming first. Yeah, that's, it should be G-L-I-M-P-S-E. Uh-oh. Ooh, thank uh, God. I'm not stupid. I thought. Okay. No, that's straight up just side. a typo. That's not... I mean, is this game, like, released or is it early access? I'd give it a pass if it was early access. <laughs> Fucking up the literal, like, first sentence <laughs> or, like, first page of, of text that I see is a little, a little cringe. TBH. Are you, are you checking out your tips? I'm not. Stay alert for special sounds. Be thorough. Inspect items and doors closely. My specialty. I can hear the audio. The audio is here. Hello, Solar. You know, back in the day, uh, loading screens used to have little games that you could play on them, but then one company trademarked the ability to do that, so no one could legally do it again. And that trademark, I'm pretty sure, ran out like five or ten years ago, but no one's just ever oh, done it am again. Am I wearing a paper bag? Oh, shit. No, we're just phasing into each other. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. Oh. Ooh. Help. What? There's a phone somewhere, I think. Or like, quote unquote, up. There's I a... think this book is, is the calling. Portal? Oh, the, he says he. there's a book calling. Oh, it's a book. Oh. Use device. No, we got to find a book. Oh, wait, Finally, wait, wait, wait. You are here. Yes, Jesus. yes. I'm a talking book. Get over it. Look, you're probably wondering what you're doing here. I promise that it all makes sense soon enough. Do I look cute, though? For yeah, you now, look pretty good. You gotta help me! I'm trapped, you see, and you are kind of trapped in here with me. Sorry about that. This gives off the same vibe as an escape room with, like, I'll the cheese. I'll explain everything along the way. I was gonna say first this, man. things first, though. <laughs> We'll need to get the cube. He sounds like a TikTok person. <laughs> he does. The cube is over here. The cube? Yeah, the cube is here. How do you know it's the cube? Well, it's the only it's the oh! only ominous floating cube okay, in here. Okay, sorry. So. I only saw the circle. Okay. I think it's E to interact. Uh, I just clicked and it did it. So, we got to figure out what to do with this. Can oh, I not, rotate clock hand. Can I not use it because you're using it? I think so. Yeah. Go that's find a, a clock for me. A clock? Okay. Clock boy, go find a clock. Fetch me a clock, clock boy. Um. Tick tock. Oh, I found a oh, coded a door. Combination lock. How absolutely unimaginative. <laughs> Judgment represents self-reflection, right. redemption, and judgment. Well, found I found a card. card. Oh, are we like collecting cards too? I I guess we're doing quite a few things, but I'm still not finding a clock. I mean, I can do a process of elimination. I guess I just figured. I mean, there's only twelve numbers in a clock, you know. I guess you there are two hands. Oh, hello. Take skull. Tip. Press F to inspect. Oh, I found a card. What card did you find? The Fool. Oh, nice. Denotes okay. new beginnings, unpredictability, and a carefree attitude. There's gotta be a clock around here somewhere. Ooh. Let 
me inspect this vase. Hmm. Just like takes two, talking book. Man, you guys have been asking us to play take two for like months at this point. We should hey, probably do it. Hey, I found this it. weird um, snowflake number thing. That's cool. Do you think that oh. could? Oh. Oh god, you're right next to me. Jeez. Do you think this thing could be the numbers we're looking for? Oh, what if it's the combination lock? Hold on. No, because the combination lock is letters, not numbers. I think I'm this leave thing. I'm going to that cabinet open as a reminder. Five, three, seven, four, six, two, one, starting with the top left. So maybe that's it. This game looks cool. It is pretty cool. I just hope we can get past the literal first puzzle. Ooh, I took a skull. I cannot jump. Oh yeah, I noticed that in the beginning that there's a. I can crouch though. Yeah. Okay. Inventory. These tabs. Oh, hey, look! I found another one of these things. Oh. This must be the combination lock. Oh, and I found another card. Fuck, I'm so good at this. Um. Inspect. Oh, I got a, uh, a, a letter. A door. I am once again reminded of my trip to Cairo so long ago. The conversations I had with my colleague, whom I assumed was insane at the time. He was speaking of having dreams. Dreams about meeting a god. Ooh, it's Cthulhu. Mm. Later, right before he was ushered away to the awful institution in London... He grabbed and whispered to me, The way is open. We must break apart. Then we can be gods. One that is three. Now I am beginning to understand what he might have been trying to tell me. <laughs> if only I had listened. I have no idea where to start with this combination lock. Like, what denotes the first thing? I would imagine it's the top left. E-E-T-M-N. Let me in! T. Oh yeah, I forgot about crouching. And can you? And then I think it's L. Can you tell me? Um, actually, never mind, because you wouldn't know what orientation I chose. Um, Don't mind L -E. me. Can you make a word out of these? Is that what I'm not getting here? All right. Um, it's the number one card got spot. three E's. Um, T, L, N, and M. Because I'm wondering if the combination lock is a word as opposed to just the things. Men? No. No. But he's an A. You need an A for that. Not three E's. What do you make with three fucking E's? Yeah, well, I, obviously they're not all together. Bells are... Repellers of witches and evil spirits, and their sound is symbolic of creative power. They were used by alchemists to conjure benevolent spirits to guide them. They were worn as ambulance and hung around the necks of animals, important to the community. Cats, dogs, and horses. Oh. Um. Hmm. I mean, obviously this thing has to be for the combination lock, and I think we're not getting... We're not figuring out the... Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, holding. I think I think I figured it out. This thing here, yeah, I think is related to this one that's up here. Okay. So, like, if you if you look over here, yeah. the numbers will tell me which letters in what order need to go on the thing. Oh, okay. So what's in the number one spot? E. Yeah. Okay. E. And then two would be L. I think I got it. If there's an L here, yeah. Okay. Element. No? No. Element. I don't think it's a word, actually. Element. I think it is. I think it's element. You think it might be? Oh, I think it is. Ah! I'm s word puzzles. Yeah, because element... element. I knew there was a reason uh... I was playing wordscapes at work. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. I got it. You're not okay. completely um, useless. Nice. Alright, I guess I'll abandon the cube for now. A card. Man, this is just like JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Part 3. Except with less sexy vampires. Symbolizes fairness, truth, and responsibility. The Justice card. Oh, okay. Well, we need to insert the cube here. So we do actually need a cube. There is a piece of hey, paper here. This looks important. Alright. Something horn, is missing horn. here. Horn. 
used to start or close the ceremony since ancient times. So I found, okay. I found a piece of paper. The chat can't see it because your thing is in the way. But I'm in the way. I think I might move your camera a little bit so the chat can see. Okay. I found a horn that I want to put on this unicorn. Uh, there we go. Okay. Now the chat can see. So I found a, a card with an infinity symbol on it, and also the numbers of a clock face, it looks like. Oh, clock quarter So 920 and 700. Is that 7 o'clock and 9? That's 5 okay. o'clock. 700 is 5 o'clock. Okay. Or What's... 1700 is 5 o'clock. It's not 1700, it's just seven. It's just 700, zero zero, so 7 o'clock. Oh, the, f the one on the left is 9.20, and the one on the right is 7 o'clock. Yeah, Puggy wanted to come sit in my lap, so now she's here and she's going to snarf, and you guys have to listen to it. Uh, sorry, the one on the right is 7 o'clock? Yeah. Six. I hope this isn't like the last game we streamed oh. where you couldn't read the clock. I got it! Ah, All right. Quite the treasure. Took me I like this game a lot better than the last one we played. <laughs> Wait, do that again. What? Keep trying, to, keep trying to go to your right. No, 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 sorry, your left. Your legs, like, keep trying to turn, but your body doesn't catch up. Very amazing. <laughs> I do like the designs for our characters. I think they're cool. I've inserted the cube. Ooh, this is some real Dwemer shit. Take. Take the cube. Oh. Ah, the tools of our trade. Here we can battle fame, through glory, and even. Hey, that's from Harry Potter. Nice fucking try. Never mind. You get the idea. We make potions here. I got the lovers. Signifies love, passion, and connection. That's us. Wow, romantic. That's me on the right with boobs and a penis. Um, I'm gonna throw this cube somewhere. Uh, there's gotta be somewhere that- I'm Oh just... no, ye old guide to alchemy, not another one of these. Why does every fucking game need an alchemy-related puzzle? Alright, I put the cube under this lion. Okay. So... There. I will, um, read you this note. The great work, magnum opus, I did the research, I ran the experiments, I searched for answers. All in inconclusive. If there's one pattern across all my peers that attempted to walk this path, it is this. They were all declared insane. They all died or disappeared during their experiment, and the work they left behind seems incomprehensible, as if only made sense to them. This feels very uh, Cthulhu-esque, just saying. It feels a little Cthulhu-esque, yeah. I remember the book. I know what happens. Um. Alright, select your recipe from the bookmarks on the right of the book. I'm going to see if this door can be opened. It can. Tutorial. It's a bit dark. Nothing we can't fix okay. with a oh, bit okay. of alchemy. Okay, okay. I'm going to make a light potion. Yes. I found an area where a light potion is needed. I'm going to search the room around it just to see. It's a grimoire, a textbook of magic. One could find in them instructions on how to create talismans and amulets, how to perform magical spells, how to summon supernatural entities, and how to recreate an alchemical formula. And then a note that says... Many shapes, many names, all the same, all to one end. If I am to do this, I will need help. But how can I find help with something I must do by myself? I don't know. You should probably get yourself a wife. Oop, another card. Okay. The Hanged Man. Portrays sacrifice, forbearance, and letting go. Choose the right ingredients. All right, I need... Oh, okay. Uh, mushrooms. Sulfur. And chalk. I found a rune puzzle. This well, device looks cooking. incomplete. <laughs> Let him cook, Jesse. Jesse. We need to cook. Um, How's everybody doing today? I hope everyone's doing well. Finally, stir the pot. Oh my gosh, wait, is this like the fucking cooking mama? Is this really like cooking mama? Oh. 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 The light potion is goes down here whenever you're ready. You finished a short hike. I'm glad that you played it. That game is is stellar. 
Okay, well, apparently I didn't actually make the potion, so... Oh, yeah. No, it looks like you, you fucked it up. Fuck me. Alright. I will patiently await completion of the puzzle. Unless... And then... Um, it says, the end, unless thou sucketh, in which case thou must try again. Thou thinks my cock is dirty. So how do I get my potion? Um, I don't know. You want me to take a crack at it? It's giving me, like, a positive-sounding noise. Yeah, I can hear it, too. But it's not... Choose the right ingredients. Finally, stir the pot. Press left-click when the diamond is within the bracket. I mean, it sounds like you're doing it correctly. Potion, please. Did it brew? The end, unless you... Yeah, and then you gotta try again. Okay. Maybe you're not using the right ingredients? No, I definitely am. Okay. Um... And it needs two heat. Yep, I'm on two heat. Okay. Do I need to, like, stir it a certain number of times? I'm sorry to hear you're not doing so well, Dingo. Maybe it's uh maybe it's because you went to go see the Mario movie and now that you're not experiencing the Mario movie, you're sad because you don't. Because I know you're really excited to see it. It's it's like when you watch a show and you like follow it all the way to the end and then it's done and you're like, what do I do with my life now? What will you do without Chris Pratt's Mario? Be sad, I guess. Um hello. Let me try the alchemy thing. I want to see. Okay. All right. Let me let me take a look here. Yeah. Um. Tip. Hold this to zoom in. Okay. So where's my recipes? Light potion. It needs two heat. Guys, look, it's another bunghole. Okay. I need sulfur, chalk, and mushroom. Bunghole. Okay. Sulfur, chalk, and mushroom. Okay. Choose the right ingredients, finally stir the pot, and do the thing on the bracket. Okay. I don't quite understand. Oh, wait, hold on. Add magical crystals to change the color of the fire. Now, the fire is correct. Yep, fire's correct. Fire's correct. Choose yeah. the right ingredients. Ingredients. For the apothecary. Yeah, no, we're, we're doing everything. Mushroom, chalk, and sulfur. What happens if I get it outside? It okay. Yeah, it makes a sad noise. I literally got it dead center. Is the potion like done somewhere, and we're just not seeing it? <laughs> I didn't think so. I'm not sure what's going on here. It glows when it's ready. Oh wait, hold on. No, there's no. Check your inventory. Are there any potions in there? No potion. The fire is correct. No bitches. I don't understand what we're missing here. Because it looks like we've got everything. Do we need like a jar? Are we missing a like a little... Are we missing a, a thing to store it? Get the, get the cum jar. Oh. Oh. Oh, you did it. I did it, yeah. Let there be light. How... Okay, so... How? The way that you do... Did you take my fucking potion? No. <laughs> you fucking thief. Okay, so the way that you do it is you have to let it stir for a little while, and then you do it. You can't just do it immediately, because then it isn't stirred. Oh. Okay, You're just too impatient. Behold, we 
banish the darkness. Yay. You know, for what it's worth, I'm sorry for what I put you through. I mean, you probably are not sure what you are even. Okay. I barely understand our situation anyway. myself, if I'm honest with you. Curse. I promise you, though, that at the end of this, it will all make sense. All of it. I think we need the cube, because I saw a place to put it. We're going to need a fire potion. Okay. To do we burn have the a thing. recipe for that, though? I don't know if we do. Oh, I found a tunnel. Excuse Was that a flask of cum? Yeah, dude, you didn't know? All oh, yeah. light is powered by cum. All right, I'm putting the cube in there. This very large hole won't let me in. You're a bit too thick to fit through there. Your cheeks are too dummy thick. I do be true, though. Oh, 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 give me, give me. Honeycomb. Ah, yes, honey. Now we can make ourselves tiny. Yes. <laughs> Dope. Yes. Adding the recipe for shrink potions to the recipe book. All right, I trust you. You can do it. All right, I got this. You just have right to let it stir a little bit. All right, shrink potion needs to be blue. Get in there. It needs to be. This is just like cooking, Mama. <laughs> Honeycomb. Rat tail. This is way less cryptic and shitty than that other game we played where where the whole like mixing together the plant shit was super terrible and complicated. How many rednecks did we have to sacrifice in order to make all these rat tails? One trip to the trailer park is, is all you need. So and then it works. Oh, it's when the, the numbers turn yellow. There's a potion that can make you shrink. Hey! And a cake that can make you I'm grow. gonna drink the blue the cake, chug however, jug potion and you can't stop me! Oh my god, did he really just say that? I did. It's not letting me drink the potion, though. Um, How do I drink the potion? Did you go to your inventory? Oh, I have to hold it. Oh, look how small I'm very small. <laughs> We are making progress. You and I Should make I a good also team. Be small? <laughs> I don't know. Probably not. I'll let you know. Magical sphere. Look, I found an orb we can ponder. <gasps> a crystal ball, also known as a crystal sphere, is a fortune telling object. It's generally associated with the performance of scrying and divination. John D claimed that the crystal sphere was given him by an angel, Uriel, who instructed him on how to ponder the philosopher's stone. We should play cash with this orb. Or with this cube. <laughs> I'm having a great time just chugging it. Okay, you can get into this room through the first room, because I unlocked the door that was in that room. Oh, alright, hang on, let me get the cube. And then there's gems that need to be inserted in here. I found... Sorry, the first room, as in, like, downstairs? As in, like, where we started. Yeah, okay, downstairs. Atham. An Atham is a ceremonial blade used in magic traditions. It... Typically has a black handle and is used to channel channel and direct psychic energy. It is one of the four elemental tools in oculism, occultism. Okay, representing fire or air. It is not intended to harm or draw blood, but to create boundaries in the magical circle. Oh. Text is hard to read here. A box with a code that I don't know the combination to, and the tower signifies sudden change, upheaval, and chaos. Oh, we need a potion to fix this. To... There's a pile of rocks here. I'm not um... really sure what to do about it. Um... it oh, use button. Use button? Bell. Yeah, we don't Boat. have the combo for that. I remember seeing gems back in the other room. Yes. I also recall. I'm gonna see if we can pick those up now, maybe. Let's go this way. Oh, yeah, we still don't have the horn. Or do we have the key? Another bunghole! There's so many. Where did I see those gems? Uh, you saw them on the table with the green uh, machinery upstairs. The green machinery upstairs. Here? I'm not looking at your screen. Oh. I'm coming, though. Oh, this this rune thing over here. Yeah, I can't take any of these gems, though. Oh, that's stinky. That is stinky. All right. There's got to be something we're looking for here. Oh, wait. I already forgot where it was. 
Is this? No, I can't. I can't even adjust it at all. So that's not relevant yet. Okay. Um. Hmm. Oh. The king and queen, symbols of nobility. Maybe that's it. And silver, body and soul. Could you tell me the symbols that are on that thing back there, and then I can tell you these symbols here? Yes. Because if those symbols match this thing, oh, I need a coin. I don't have a coin. That might work. Sorry, I walked through a doorway and immediately forgot what I was doing. <laughs> That's a real thing. <laughs> yeah. Um, Alright. We got... Uh, from left to right, we got a moon, a shell, two circles, like a Venn diagram, mm -hmm. a sailboat, a sun, and a bell. Not a single one of those is on this thing here. Yep. Can you interact with that thing? I can. Uh, oh, and you, the... need a, you need a coin. When I clicked on it before, the dude told me something about it, but that's about it. Oh, maybe we need another shrinking potion, but we need to go somewhere else. Like, there's another hole somewhere, maybe? Vines! Right, oh, disgusting! Way. Hideous! Slippery vines! Hmm. Where, where else would it be useful to be very, very small? I thought I saw a key. In the other room. I'm gonna I'm gonna look in that other room real quick. I wasn't able to pick it up. I thought. Let's see nothing here. Nothing here. Where, where was that key? There it is. Yeah, I can't pick it up for whatever. Oh, maybe if I move the cube. Hmm. Make an Among Us potion. At 3 a.m. If you drink the Among Us potion at 3 a.m. Oh, wait. That's That did something. Ho ho! I found a thing. The moon and the sun, a ship and a shell. The treasure is yours if you ring a bell. Okay. Moon, sun, ship, shell, bell. Okay. Yeah, moon, Are you about to go do that? Sun, ship, shell, bell. Hold on. Moon, sun, sip, shell, bell. And then. Uh. It, it doesn't say anything else. Does it mean, like, the actual fucking bell? No. It's definitely not it. Hmm. Come bring that bell, boy. The moon and the sun. A ship and a shell. A treasure is yours if this rings a bell. So... Huh. I got it! What did you do? I just hit the, um... The Ooh. Smell of what is that? In spite of how it looks, rot. a rather useful alchemical component. I'll add the recipe to your book. Sorry, um, I hit the Venn diagram circles and then the bell. Oh, okay. Because it says rings a bell. Uh, I see, I see. Yeah, I didn't get that at first. Puggy snoring ASMR. Yeah, she she's a baby. She's tired. Alright, we need a decay potion. Straight up, I went to my in-law's house not too long ago, and they just started talking about Puggy. And they said that they just started talking shit. They just said she's not a lap dog. And that's just a fucking lie. She literally wants to sit on my lap all the time. She's sitting here right now. They just don't have the right laps. No, you know? they don't. They don't understand. Their their complaint was that it was Puggy's fault, that she's too fat to fit on a lap, but she's literally like a runt. She's smaller than your average pug size. Maybe this one could I was kind of mad about it. Some problems. Oh, okay. That's the stinky acid potion we need for those stinky vines. Yes. Fuck Disintegrate them. 
God, there's a lot of them. Um... Oh, we need to use a shrink potion. Luckily, I have one. Hold on, let me get the cube. I think it's way in the other room. <laughs> hey, Boyd. Ha! I shrunk it. Put that in my inventory. Fucking gnomes. Once my tax return comes back... It'll all be over for you bitches. Oh, actually, my tax return did come back. I think I can fill out Twitch's stuff and, like, become a Twitch partner now. Now that Were my tax... Were you really just waiting for tax season to be done? Uh, yeah, because Twitch has a thing where it needs to see your tax information before you can become a partner. And it's said to use the most up-to-date thing, so I thought it would make sense to do this year's. Because it has my new name on it. Hey, the cube is all set. Oh, no. It was just doing that thing. I forgot it does that. Get, get. Oh. Pinecone. Pinecone. A symbol for human enlightenment. They're hating on her because they can't the handle her. Oh, I mean, for part. sure. They don't like that you can't just pick Puggy up because if you try to pick her up, she flails around in the air because she doesn't like not being on the ground. So they're cranky. that They say she's not a lapdog because they can't just, like, hold her in front of them like a human baby. You can carry her, you just have to carry her like a football. Puggy likes to be carried like a little football. Unless she's wearing clothes. If she's wearing clothes, then she likes to be carried like a baby. But only That's if true. she's wearing clothes. Toadie could hit us with ads soon. It's not so much the ads, I could care less about that. It's mostly so that you guys can do things. I was told that you guys can, like, pay for things to happen on the stream. Which is kind of cool. I don't know. I'll fiddle around with it. Pay a dollar to let to tell Tony to show his tits. Where oh, that's going, right. You will need eyes to see. Interesting. All right. Um, I'm I'm gonna drink this. Where do wait? Why don't we? Why don't we drink it in the other room? Because there's stuff over here. Reveal. Oh. What? Babe, I reveal the vase for you. Look. See? Oh. Take the vase. That was expensive. I just revealed that for you. Yeah, but there's a key in it, and now we can go in here. I remember Meek said uh, that I should have you guys have a thing where I'll just fucking open card packs at a certain amount of whatever's bits or whatever they're oh, called. This is. I'd do that. Ooh. Hold on. Hang Maybe. on, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I think we need the cube. Cool. Tony, when are you going to do a hot tub stream? Um, I guess when I redo my bathroom. When I, I redo my bathroom, then we'll, have a, then we'll have a jacuzzi tub I can use. So maybe in a year. Or I guess I could just, like, fill up a kiddie pool with hot water and we can pretend, you know? Ah, uh, my stupid normal sight came back. Oh, is this the horn I was looking for? It is. You can take the potion next time. I did not enjoy it. I have a mortgage now. I also have a mortgage, Dingo. It's congrats okay. Congrats on having a mortgage. Also, yeah, congrats on that. I'm not over here fishing for donations or whatever, but it was recommended to me that I, uh, that I at least to become a partner. I don't know if that'll help me boost my viewership. <laughs> oh, I just realized this. There's one you gotta of these charge here. that horn, baby. We have to charge the horn? Yes. Oh, no, you just take the horn off and it opens the door. I'll just leave that there for now. What do we have in here? Oh, wow! I don't remember this being here! Use lever? Oh, God. Oh, wait. I need to drink my Among Us potion. I can't move this lever. My, my hands are not strong enough. Hmm. I'm trying to I'm trying to move, but it. Oh, what are your elf eyes see, Legolas? Oh. Oh, okay. I see symbols. Okay. This, um, shit. Her Samungus potion. I don't know what to tell you about these. Can you just look at my screen? <laughs> yeah. It's so small, I can't. See. <laughs> so, just. Remember oh, those. okay. We got um, infinity, we got a scepter, we got a 24, and we got a heart. Oh. It did something, I don't know. Oh god. 
Insert the cube? Oh. Don't worry, I found it. I don't have the cube. You were the last person to have the cube. Yeah, I threw it down the stairs. You didn't notice? <laughs> <laughs> wow, what a good use of the cube. It's a great use of the cube. I like the cube because it shows us how far we're progressing. Broken? Who? How? A talisman. A talisman is any object described with religious or magical powers intended to protect, heal, or harm individuals for whom they are made. Talismans are often portable objects which are inscribed with magic texts. Bunhole. Another one? Yep. Oh. Um, the first phase is complete. Will it suffice? Will I understand? What decisions will I make? I have no regrets. I have no fear. My only enemy is time. Solar says that cubes love being thrown down the stairs. Just like my grandma. Oh, hey. What does this one do? I'm resetting this device. Oh. Oh, I, th I think I... I see. Okay. It's telling me how to do the things. Alright, well, I'll leave you to that. That one. That one. That one. That one. Okay. That one. It's unfortunately a little tough to remember. Um, oh, okay. Interesting. They're so, like, non-distinct that it's a little challenging. Well. And then I think it was this one? No, it was... Oh, is it just going on its own? Oops. Oh, it is. Okay. The line. Where's the line one? This one. I just need to wait for this to go again. The line, and then it goes to the... 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 the this one. I think I got that one right. Let me just double check. Is this? And then the coat hanger. I love. Wait, I love that this has like an inspection sticker on it. And then, That'll give you like the serial name and everything. Yeah, why would I know constellations? What am I, a girl on Tumblr? Damn it. Silver coin. Ooh. Nah. Did you get it? I got a silver coin. Yeah. Ooh, put it in the coin thingy. Oh wait, not that way. This way. Time to go pay the king and queen. Well, actually, this one has the queen's face on it, so I guess she's going to give us something. Boink. It's blue. It's blue now, yeah. What does that mean? Alright, well, we need more coins. I made chug jug juice, but I, I already... We already drank chug jug juice. Constellations aren't real. You're telling me stars know what a bear is? They're homophobic. <laughs> I don't believe that uh, that anything in the sky is real. Oh, it's all just water, dude. I have this in my inventory. What do you have in your inventory? I have this hexagon. Oh. Um. Okay. I feel like we need your Among Us potion to see what's to see what's right here. Oh. Okay, wait, hang on. Wait, try making this thing here. Yeah. Should I do the circled one? Do the do the top one. It'll charge up the gem, I think. And then we can put that gem into a thing. Put it in the gachapon machine and get a small Sonic the Hedgehog figure. <laughs> get a small Chris Pratt who says things from the Mario movie. Sam doesn't even know how to replicate Nordic runes. This is cringe. Well, you do that. I'm gonna go... Maybe upstairs? <laughs> Why do we, wait, I genuinely don't know how to replicate Nordic runes, though. Okay, let me do it. 
This this calls for a man's touch. Vikings were all men, obviously. That's why they had to steal women from other places. All That's right. why they were desperate enough to Have steal fun. British women. Okay. Um. So it's a pointy uppy and then a pointy uppy again. This seems this seems doable. Damn, Puggy be looking real cute right now, you guys. That's because she is cute. Okay. The Among Us Potion. I almost had it. Tony, can I send a picture of Puggy to the chat? Yeah, if you want to. Fuck yeah. This is, um... I am doing it in the Discord, because I don't think I can send it in the... No, nah, you'd have to post it onto the Discord. This is um, a Beep, little more there complicated she is. than I thought. But why is it that some of them... Aha! Not so easy, is it? No, it's not. Um, oh, I, I got one. I, I, okay. How do I reset this fucking machine? No. No, I just want to reset it. I think you just have to exit. No, I did that. It didn't work. If I use it, will I cut you off? No. Oh! Oh! You got the arrow! You were so close! No, I have one arrow. I need, I need two arrows, though. Oh, God. This is very challenging. I, I don't quite understand it. I'm so close, like it's almost there. Rotate the... Rotate the hexagon. That's what I have been doing. See, I, got, I can get one of them. But two? That's, that's like too much for me. I really just don't understand how this puzzle works. Alright, kick off. I'll try. Okay. We're gonna and we're gonna need to replicate that like another four or five times to get into this room. Hmm. See, so is there anything else in the constellation room? Let me just check in here. I don't have what I need to repair that. I'm not entirely certain what this room is for. Puggy is the most deflated little child in the whole wide world. Let's see, hiding things in plain sight. Hmm. So I need a pine cone, a bat wing, and a wanna egg. Hmm. Wanna egg. Pine cone. A bat wing. It's a quick brew. You did oh! it? Did you do it? I did it! Nice. Oh! It's a wind gem. The air gem is okay. finished. Alright, where the fuck did those where those gems supposed to go? Um Oh, I think maybe in the unicorn room. He called that one the elements room, so that might be it. Nope, not that one. No slots to put this in here? Okay. Oh, no, not this room. We'll find it, we'll find it. Did you figure out how to do it, or did you just brute force it? Oh, I just brute forced it. I just kept fiddling until Down I here. found it. Like any good explorer. <laughs> it's, um... It's in the room that we had to shrink down to get into. Not helpful. The, what do you mean? You haven't learned the layout yet? What? It's not letting you put it in? He just told me to stop it and get some help! Disrespect. Right, hang on. Uncharged. Ooh, how do I charge it? 
Oh. I need to charge my crystals. For the sesh? Oh no. Um, guys. How about we gather all the crystals first? Alright, fine. I'll put it back in my inventory. Um, oh. I like that I can just walk through you. Um, there was another banner somewhere. It was that one that you made appear with your sight. Yeah, it looked like real good at it. Oh yeah, here it is. In the steam room. This one looks not impossible to do. Oh wait, I'm looking at this one, which is just the full motherfucker. The full rune. Yeah, that should be easy. You say that, but we'll see. Oh, it also tells you what element it is. That's useful. How would we charge a crystal? Can I have the crystal while you're doing this? Uh, it should be in the inventory. Do we share an inventory system? We do not, no. Oh wait, apparently we do. Okay. If I put this on the unicorn, will that charge it? Insert charged horn. Yeah, I remember that's where, that's where I saw the phrase. I put the horn back. Ha 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 ha! Got it! Nice. Earth gem. Okay, earth gem. An uncharged elemental gem of earth. Okay, and then we have, um... So that's the full shebang, and then in this room we've got this in here. Oh, it's the one that looks like a stick. Yeah, the twig one. Where would one go to charge a crystal for their sesh? Hmm, I can think of something, says Dingo. If your answer is to put the gem in my butt, I don't know. What if you lost the fucking horde? <laughs> Thank god I didn't. You can just put anything in your inventory if you press Q, which is nice. Alright, I got the stick, but it's the wrong way around. Oh. Well, that's only... oh shit. How do we get up there? Like the king and the queen. Um. Well, in the meantime, I can I try. Got it. Nice. Okay. Well One more. All right. I just need water. Okay. I have not seen a fourth. Do you think we need alchemical site? What tells you if the, if you need alchemical site? Like, what's the hints? Um, it's gonna, it's gonna look really nauseating, and it's gonna shimmer. Like this shimmering right here? Let's try this. Enhanced eyes! No. Oh, oh right there. Da, 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 da. And then there's a swirly bit on the door here. Okay, do you see this one? Yeah. Oh, that's so good. Hmm. I have to figure out what to what to do to charge these though. Ooh, what about the elements room? Oh, wait, hold on. Got it. Nice. Good job. Something about this. Maybe we just don't know how to do it yet, but. I unfortunately can't move that. Charging crystals. Hmm. The only place I've seen the word charge is when it tells me to put a charged horn on the unicorn. On the unicorn. Do you still have that horn? I do. It doesn't let me use it, sadly. Hmm. Oh, babe, we have to go drop it in the thing. Drop what in the thing? The horn. You th oh, you think? Yeah, let me try that. No, it says insert coin. So that ain't it. 
have it? You have the horn? I Yeah, I've had the horn on me. It doesn't let me put it in here. It only says coins can go in there. That's stupid. That is stupid. Um... Hmm... Do we need to maybe, like, stick them in some fire? It might be over here with this contraption, but I'm not entirely certain what this contraption wants. Oh, it has numbers on it. And doing stuff fiddles with the numbers. I'm not sure what it does, but... Sometimes I can make it go up and then down. Other times it does nothing. Hmm. That ain't it. Where's that room with the... Where's the... Oh, it's in the in the downstairs. That's right. Okay. Um... Oh, I'm gonna see if I can toss the fire gem into the fireplace. I was just about to do that. Oh, did you do it already? I did not. I did not try. I'll let you do it. So it didn't... No. Huh. Look. Stop it. Get some help. No. Doesn't seem right. Huh. Look. It's obviously missing something. Uh-huh. Okay. Um... Nope, it won't let me throw it in the fireplace. The only bit that we're missing... Maybe. Hold on. Maybe we need a potion for that wall? Did that potion have a symbol, maybe, and that could do it? Let me see. I thought it was to look here at the recipe book. Decay potion. Shrink potion. No. None of those are right. The symbols on that steam machine are symbols for planets, except the infinity one, I think. I think one of those symbols matches this fucking window, too. We should take a crack at this machine in here, because this seems to be the only thing we haven't done to progress. Okay. Actually, can I just... Yeah, I'll just put the cube in my inventory. Hmm... I'm not quite sure what the machine is asking, though, and I'm not even certain what these levers are going to do. Hmm. Yeah, until the machine's ready, I can't activate this to go in here. I need to go down. Go down. It makes it go up. It makes it go down. I can only make this one on the left go up by one or down by one. That's the only thing I'm capable of making it do. Tasks completed. It doesn't look like we can insert anything in here. Do you want to brew another alchemical eye potion, maybe? Oh, I still have one. Hang on. I don't have one. Um... Can you reveal anything in this room? Like, on the thing itself? Also pretty cool, your eyes are all blue. Like, can you click the symbols here on the machine? Um, possibly, but hang on, I ran out. Okay. Tasks like Among Us, ew. Puggy. Are you a little creature? I should make a podcast of just Puggy snoring. Some people think that a pug snoring would be really annoying, but those people have never had one before. When you own a pug, it's great, because that's, that's like your little creature. So when she's snoring, it's very cute. And soothing. Helps you sleep. See if you can activate these runes. Or or maybe if you hit the levers, it'll do something. No, 
nothing. No. Yeah, I don't quite get it. Maybe, um... I'm a bit stumped. Something with this room? No? She's just a little baby, she snores. Nothing in here. Huh. I'm just gonna start clicking on everything, I think. When in doubt, that's like the easiest thing to do. It's kind of weird that like the one coin I found here did one thing. So I think we're missing another coin. The gold coin, I guess. Hmm. I really hope it's not that steam machine over there because I really just don't understand it. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna try the steam machine again. Hmm. The infinity one looks like the Leviathan cross, but I could be wrong. I haven't brushed on, on my symbols lately. But even if that is what it is, I... That doesn't mean anything to me. One of them is definitely for, like, Saturn or Jupiter or something. I made it go up twice. There is a combo that you're supposed to do, I just don't fully understand it. I th think I figured it out. Okay. Hitting these switches moves the steam to different parts of the machine. Okay. So... I think those directions of the steam correlate to the things, and those things, the symbols, and they need to be in, an, in a specific order. But I don't know enough about the symbols to know which would come first and which wouldn't. Which means there has to be something here. Like a, well, there's a piece of paper in the back here. The first phase is complete. Will it suffice? Will I understand what decisions will I make? I have no regrets. I have no fear. My only enemy is time. does the steam mean? It just seems to randomly select where it's going to go, you know? Okay. So when it's up here, do this lever. When it's down here... Don't do that lever. Let me see. Will this work? Okay, when it's up here, do this lever. When it's over there, do that lever. When it's down there, do that one. And then when it's on that side, that one should work. Okay, alright. I'm, I'm doing something. It's actually working this time. Oh god. Okay, I progressed the steam machine a little bit. Yay! Um, now I have another pressure gauge, and I'm not sure what it does. That one's green. Can I move this? I can't. Blue. Green. Okay. Oh, you need to hit the right color when it's on the thing. So green is this, blue is this, 
Pink is this. No. Green is this. Blue is this. Pink is this. Green. Blue. Pink. I'm actually doing it. I'm I'm figuring it out little by oh, little. Wait, hang on. I need the, um... The sight? No, we don't need the sight potion. I yes, just need to pay. Do. Why? Oh, to see the, the clock. I see. So... That is over this one. Interesting. That one... It's a clock. It's here. Oh, wait, I know what you have to do. What do we do? You have to make the symbols with each of the little doodads. Oh, uh, okay. So, like, this, this, how do you, how are you moving them? You move them with the levers. Each lever moves an individual component. That one goes there. Did you do the second lever already? Mm, I don't think so. Yeah, you did. Okay, so that one's good. That one's good. 